Hello Scorpio, so this is the reading that I got for you guys for the month of June. So I'm seeing June as what the hell, <laughs> and I'm seeing it like the energy is everywhere. Like it's like very scattered and it's very sporadic. Um, that's what I'm seeing for June um, for Scorpios. But it's still showing that you guys do have the power. You guys can come out on top in any situation, okay, with the magician being there. Mm -hmm. It's just that it's a lot of, like, what the hell, <laughs> okay? Um, now, when I was doing, um, when I was getting these cards, okay, because usually I wait for the cards to come out while I'm shuffling. And then I wait until all the cards came out so I can um, analyze the reading. And what I'm seeing is that I feel like for some of you guys you are out of a connection that you love you like you have love for this person but like you're you're done like or this person is feel like they're at the end of the relationship at the end of the connection with you or that's how you feeling like with this person but it's like you still have love for this person okay and when how okay when this thing is going on okay how you're feeling towards this person that you just recently broken up or the person that you probably gonna broke up okay um with at the same time i feel like your ex okay who who you don't like is still trying to come through and trying to see if they can have you now because they see that you're not in a relationship with the other person anymore and it's kind of like, it's kind of like a scenario or kind of like a situation where the person who come back to you is not the person that you want. And the person that you want, you want that person to come back to you. You know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like that's what's going on. It's like a lot of like, like when this person's coming through, your ex coming through that you don't want, is like, why are you here? I don't want you. I want the other person to be here. And that's why I feel like how Scorpios are going to feel like in, in, um, in June, okay? Um... Yeah, that's what I'm seeing, because I'm seeing that you got out the relationship, a connection. Some of you guys still want to be with this person, okay? But I'm seeing the past coming back, and you're kind of confused of, like, how to get the person that you want, okay? Um, you're kind of confused. That's why I think the Nine of Wands came out in reverse, too, okay? Along with the world in reverse, because you feel like everything is, like, what the hell, Okay. Now, the sign thing might be done with might be a Gemini, a Pisces, Aquarius, a Taurus, a Leo, okay, a Sagittarius as well, okay. Now, for the Romance Angels, I got pay attention to red flags, release your acts, express your love, and separation. So, this is how I'm getting from this tarot, okay, from the tarot um, initial spread. Again, the ex is trying to come through, the one that you don't want. But at the same time, the person that you recently broke up with or the person that you have a fallen out with, you still have love for them, but you guys are separated, okay? But it's like this past person who's your ex, who you don't want, is trying to come back and trying to cause like more like confusing energy for you, okay? But at the same time, I feel like you're still separated with, you separated from the person that you actually want to be in a connection with or still want to um still want them to love you okay that's what i'm saying um now when i clarify pay attention to red flags got the three of swords okay so hopefully you guys is not cheating on the person that you actually want to be with or flirting because it could be like miscommunication or someone not seeing the situation clearly and that's why that person like you know broken up with the other person okay now, when I clarify release your ex, I got the Empress in the verse and Eight of Wands in the verse. Yeah, this is someone, the ex that you don't want, <laughs> who's coming back to you. This is someone that you probably block communication, okay? If you haven't blocked communication, you just stop talking to them. They're trying to say block this person, okay? And when I clarify express your love, I got the Two of Wands, okay? So if this is your situation, I'm trying to say is really show that you still want to be with the person that you want to be with okay and when i clarify separation i got the king of cups i got the nine of cups in the verse the queen of swords and the star in the verse okay 
Yeah, I feel like someone's still in love. Someone have given up. Okay, someone stopped communicating. Okay, but someone still want this situation to work. That's what I'm getting. Like, a lot of, like, oh my gosh, like, a lot of chaotic type of energy. Um, now, when I clarify the four wands, I get the ten of swords in the verse and the strength in the verse, okay? So, yeah, I do see you recently getting out of a connection because someone was probably not the most loyal. Hopefully, it's not you guys, but that's what I'm saying. Now, I want to clarify the magician. I have the four of pentacles, I have three of pentacles in the verse, and the ten of wands. So, yeah, I'm seeing that you want something to work out, okay, with the person that you want to be with. Not the person that you don't want to be with, but the person that you want to be with. I see you want it to work out, but it's like this person's giving you a hard time, okay? That's what I'm seeing as well. Another way this can go is that if you have broken up with someone that you don't want to be with and you're single, it's like you're having a hard time manifesting someone new that you actually have a genuine connection with, okay? Now, when I clarify the world in reverse, I had the two of pentacles in the first. I also got um, the six of cups. And the lovers in reverse, okay? So that's what I'm saying. I'm seeing the ex that you don't like and don't want to resurface, to come back. Um, but you're still going to not interfere with them. I mean, not um, interact with them. But this person just coming back. And it's been a while because this ex that you don't want <laughs> um, has been kind of like antagonizing you guys. Like all the time trying to come back. I feel like they did took a break because when I was doing the readings for you for the past couple months, I didn't really get their energy, but it's showing that they are going to resurface again, okay? Which makes sense because we're about to be in Mercury retrograde, okay? Now, when I clarify the moon card, I also got the Eight of Pentacles, I have the Ace of Wands, I have the Page of Cups, and I have the Hierophant. Yeah, so I'm seeing that you want something to work out with the person that you want to be with. If you're single, you just want some connection to come through. You're trying to manifest it, okay? But it's like you feel like in both situations, in both um, scenarios, you guys feel like it's not coming through, okay? Now, when I clarify the Nine of Swords, I got the Devil in Reverse, the Two of Cups in Reverse, and the Four of Cups in Reverse, yeah. So that's what I'm getting. I feel like you guys feel like it's not working out, okay? So if you want to be with someone, you feel like this person's not letting you in. If you have got, like, if you try and get rid of this ex person that you don't want and you're trying to manifest something new, you feel like it's taking forever to manifest a new connection, okay, that you want to be in, okay? Now, when I clarify the Nine of Wands in reverse, I got the Four in reverse, the Nine of Swords, the Tower in reverse, and the Page of Pentacles. Yeah, so I'm still seeing at the end of the month, like, it's still going to be chaotic. It's still going to be a chaotic type of energy. Um, but I'm seeing at least you're going to communicate with the person that you actually want to be with, okay? Um, now, if you kind of did something wrong in the connection, I feel like they are going to hear you out and they are going to try to communicate with you. But I don't feel like this is a month that they are going to try to work it out with you, okay? Now, if you got rid, if you're trying to get rid of the acts that you don't want and trying to manifest for something new, I feel like you are probably going to put yourself out there, like, you know, start dating people. But you don't feel like like the people that you're dating in the month of June you probably feel like the connection is not that strong like how you want it to be or you feel like these are not the people that you actually will be in a relationship with okay but yeah that's what I'm getting for you Scorpios like I have a chaotic like I, what I'm seeing is like very chaotic type of energy okay a lot of scattered type of energy um, but yeah, that's the reading I got for you guys. And again, thank you guys for watching my video and subscribing if you want to book a personal reading with, 
with me, you can at queenfedatero at gmail.com.